We do golf better. Beaches. We have more than 300 to pick from. There's Flamenco. We think the most beautiful beach in the world. Just waiting for you. We do beaches better. For 500 years, people have come to Puerto Rico to create memories. It's about time. You discover why. Puerto Rico does it better. Mi gente, lo más grande de este mundo, siempre me hacen sentir un orgullo profundo. Que hackeando la playa, pasado de las rayas, por encima de la malla, no puede faltar la medalla. Conmigo sí. <risa> Lo que le gusta a tu mamá. Natalia, te he amado toda la vida. Jorge. Cásate conmigo. Y ahora, lo que te gusta a ti. Yeah. 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 Lo que le gusta a tu mamá y también a ti. <risa> Malta India, esa es la mía. And we don't want to miss any of the live action. Semi-final no. number two, Jacob Vandervelde now in the hot seat. Manny V here giving it to you live from the Encanto Pro. Look at Bobby Quinones with that Puerto Rican flag around yes. him. Yes. He is pumped. Alex Odanga, he is pumped as well. Woo. Yeah, Babby is a man. <laughs> Making it to the final at the Encanto oh, Pro. Yes. Look at that. Everybody is pumped. Uh, I mean... Let me tell you right now, please, if you are anywhere near Isabella, near Middles, and you are here in Puerto Rico, and you want to support your fellow rider, Bobby Quinones, get in your car. Yes. Get down here right now. We're going to have an expression yeah. session after the yeah. semifinal. You got about an hour yeah, to you get got, down here. You got about maybe 40 minutes to oh, get okay. down here. So you got time. Get down here. Bring your Hawaiian frags. Bring your empanadas. Bring your medalla light. Whatever it takes, get down here and see Bobby Quinones possibly take out the Encanto Pro. Oh, I would love to see it. <laughs> wow, this is so epic. Wow, amazing. So no matter what, ladies and gentlemen, we are going, going to, to the NMD versus Fronton Pro for the world title race. That Ooh. is going to be insane. I don't think we could have asked for an, any other better uh, story to be written for the world title. It's going to be insane. We're going to see Jeff Hubbard, multiple world champion, go against Dave Winchester for the world title down in Fronton. That yes. is going to be an yes. amazing, amazing world title oh race. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my. Unbelievable. Now, here is the situation. Uh, let me take a closer look at where we are. So now, if Hubbard can get out of this semifinal against um, Edder Luciano. Edder Luciano. Let's up and right in right now. Edder Luciano up on a small frothier one. He's going to punch through air. That's not going to do it in this heat, I'll tell you that right now. With Jeff Hubbard, he's going to go big. There ain't no way. But he shreds, so he can do it as well. It's anybody's <coughs> game. So now that Dave got knocked out of the semifinals, if Jeff gets a third place in this event, which means if he gets knocked out of the semifinals, that is an equal third, mm -hmm. and he makes it to the final at Fronton, that could, that could probably seal the deal for Jeff Hubbard. So we're going to get more technical as, as far oh, as... Oh, uh, that's my boy right there, too, bro. I hang out <laughs> with him all the time. Come on, Jeff. I'm sorry, but, you know, yeah. that's my boy. Well, to get closer to that world title run, it is Eder Luciano standing in the way for Jeff Hubbard now in this situation. Semi-final number two. We've already seen a few waves go down the okay. pipeline, but that one-point ride not really going to make a difference for Eder Luciano as the time winds down in the hot seat. Jacob Vandervelde from Hawaii along with myself, oh, Manny V here. And uh, let me tell you, if you're just tuning in, you've missed a lot of action. We, are, we yes. will have all of the action on our YouTube channel within the next day or so. So if you missed it, make sure you go back and watch some of these exciting heats. But now, if you're tuning in live, welcome. Welcome, bro. Welcome. It's going down. This is crazy. Oh. I think the highlight heat of the day was Jeff Hubbard and Jared Houston. Oh, my yeah, God. I was, was on the beach going crazy. That was a quarterfinal number four where they did a back-to-back -back wave exchange of just Ooh. some massive backflips. And uh, 
just a ton of acrobatics from those two riders, but it was oh. Jeff Hubbard who knocked out Jared Houston in that quarterfinal. Here he is now situated with uh, the Brazilian, Eder Luciano. Here's, Here's another look. a replay look. on that frothy one. Um, drawing a fast line. He had a good line on that, but punching through arses is not going to do it in this heat unless it just turns flat, but I doubt it. Oh, my. Hey, where are the Hawaiians at on Facebook? Yeah, let's see. Where uh, are you at, let's guys? See. Well, what time is it in Hawaii? You got your watch um, situated for that? Because I know it's, uh, like, it's three, like five. Um, it's I like three in the morning in Australia, and I already know the Australians are up and uh, awake. But uh, whether they're going to go to sleep or not, now that Dave Winchester is out of the event, will be uh, up to them. But we do have already in that first final slot Bobby Quinones. Yes. And now uh, taking out, that was Dave Winchester in that semifinal one. Now Bobby is going to face off with either Jared Hughes, I mean, sorry, Jeff Hubbard or Eder Luciano. It's 5.41 a.m. out there. It's like, so they better wake up right now. Well, there Drink you their coffee. <laughs> well, I know Big Todd <laughs> is watching. He's yeah. All, Big Todd is always tuned in. And uh, all the Hawaiians wake up. Jeff Hubbard is on a roll to not only win, possibly win the event here, but also now in the hunt for the world, ti world yes. title. But first, he has to face off with Eder Luciano. 23 yes. minutes remaining in this semifinal. Bobby Quinones, the dark horse, beating out Omri Laverne in the quarters and David Winchester in the semis to make a final berth position here yes. in the finals of the Encanto Pro. Wow. Amazing. This is all going down. It's a slow heat right now. Come on, Waves. We want some action. <laughs> Unreal. So Manny V and Jacob Vanderbilt giving you the feed from uh, Middles here in Isabella, the northwest corner of Puerto Rico. And this place has been amazing to yes, all the competitors. It and it's just, uh, what's your favorite thing about Puerto Rico since uh, you've been everything. here? Everything. I'm going to be kind of sad when I leave. I love this place, man. Same. I'm in the same boat yeah. as you. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Yeah. 22 minutes, 20 seconds remaining. Jeff Hubbard and Eder Luciano with two scores on their scorecard so far. Yep. Jeff's just waiting for a better wave. I think he's ho holding priority right now. And... The waves seem to have went flat for a bit, so. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, that's a perfect time for us to run down yes. our list of uh, shout-outs. Um, right at bb.com. Uh, that is uh, online magazine. Mm -hmm. Neymar Carvalho from Brazil is on the cover with a big air that uh, she pulled Sick. off here in the Encanto Pro last year. I got to give a shout-out to uh, Tony and his crew, Tony Apote. I met uh, I met him over at uh, our cafe down by our house. Okay. I met him. Uh, we went up there to get some lunch, and we just started chatting. And I'm like, "Hey, we're having a barbecue." Next thing you know, he shows up with his friends and like coolers full of food, beer, and just that guy was amazing. Tony, thank uh -oh. you. Oh, up, up and, and riding, riding. Jeff yeah. Hubbard. Oh, nice line. Come on, boy. He has a ramp. Bingo. Nice. Nice invert. I know he wants something bigger than that, but he needs to start off somewhere. Eder Luciano on this wave. No, no. cuts out of there. Wants he to cut, get priority. He, he cut yeah. out early to get out into the outside yes. before Jeff Hubbard does so he can retain and hold on to that priority. Yes. Ebodyboarding.com. Now is the time to buy your goods. First up and riding, Jeff Hubbard. Yeah, he had a nice line on the bottom there, and he flies on these waves. Look at that. Tweaked invert. Not wow. everybody in the world can do yeah. that <laughs> with zero speed, but get that much projection <laughs> out know. into the flats. Well, Jeff Hubbard, nice score right there. Five point. Oh, actually, still waiting for that score yes. to come in. Eder Luciano's wave, last wave, 5.75. But ebodyboarding.com, if you're thinking about buying some bodyboarding gear, now is the time to do Jay it. Jay and Vicky, yes. they're the best. They take care of you. Great, yes. great customer service. 10% off. Type in Encanto on your way out of the shopping cart ebodyboarding.com. Yes. Cleo, okay. the organization, the group that put together uh, uh, this event. Bianca, Natasha, and uh, Pamela, great, great staff. Oh, yes. Beautiful They're event wonderful. here. wonderful. A lot of people's favorite event, um, yeah. from what I hear. Out I'm on coming the, back on for sure. Scene. Oh, man. Are you this kidding me? Definitely on the to-do <laughs> list if you're on the East Coast. Yes. Or anywhere in the U.S., this is uh, definitely an you event get to get here. to. So uh, there you have it. Situation. Jeff Hubbard's last wave, 6.95 for yes, that little yes. invert on the inside. We'll take it. Woo, Boogie family, check out their Facebook page. Awesome uh, Boogie 
related uh, Facebook page. They have an online magazine. And uh, we do have the, uh, an award for the best Puerto Rican writer. And I think Natasha oh. and Bobby Quinones. Yeah, I think it's Babby for sure. And <laughs> Natasha, yeah, for sure. Yeah, check out this little art piece right here. This is from Oviani from Turista Local. I don't know if we can totally get it in there. So the best Puerto Rican will walk away. This is the for the male. So Bobby Quinones is going to walk away yes. with this pretty cool art piece. Actually, that's a nice little barrel. And some money. I'm in, <laughs> I'm in the barrel right there. Yeah. But, uh, that art piece is going to the top male Puerto Rican, which now is, uh, we all know, Bobby Quinones. We got Edder Luciano up and riding. Kind of a, he found a lip on that one. He did an ARS. He's looking for something else on the inside. Still drawing the line. Kind of frothy section. Did a roll. So that's going to that's gonna be a decent score. Uh, he already has a 5.75. Um, looks like he's going, I don't know about going all the way in. Is he trying to change board? or That's a long paddle back out there. Well, I think he's he um, knows that uh, these this is one of those heats where those bigger waves aren't going to be coming in. Um, yeah. As we've seen throughout the entire event, there, there's going to be heats where it's back-to-back -back action nonstop, and then Mother Nature takes this. It's just weird because it stops right on the start of some heats, oh. and uh, there's not a lot of action in the water. I mean, you faced you you were in one of those heats that uh, I was with this guy, Edder Luciano, yeah, where the the waves just stopped. Yes, it did. Yeah, he's drawing a nice line on this one. He stalled all the way and found a lip. Wow, that was nice projected air. <laughs> oh my yes. god, that was that yes. was all the way out into the face of the wave. Let's see what drops. That was pretty insane. Uh, a smaller wave though, but uh, a solid uh, score will. B oh, and another nice extended yes. roll. You know what? That was going to be probably the highest wow. score of yes, the heat it is. so far. Oh my, Edder Luciano. That is the reason why Woo. he took it all the way to the beach. That's going to be in the high sevens for it's sure. It's eight point two five. There Manny. you go, eight point oh two five. Edder Luciano in that rip current, which will take him out to the outside. Look at this. Oh, oh. Jeff Hubbard. Can he hold on? Yes, he can. Oh my, big flip out the back for Jeff Hubbard on that wave. That's going to take a, totally take away that four point five wave. Yes, Let's it. take another look right off the bat. Oh, Jeff Hubbard oh. taking a look. Uh, well, we'll get back to that yeah, replay we'll in just there. a second, but Jeff Hubbard with a solid flip yes. on his uh, third wave of the heat. <laughs> here it is. Yeah, here it is, drawing a clean line. It's already flying. I don't know how. Look, he finds a lip. Oh, perfect. He had some air on that one. Let's see what he gets for that, but that was sick. And he pushed his way through, so wow. Um, We'll see. Looks like a pretty decent score, but not as high as Edder's um, 8.25. So we'll see what happens on this. Uh, he did get a 6.75. So he has a combination. Yeah, you don't see that on your score, your screen just yet. Um, it'll pop there. Yes, there it is. So right now, Edder Luciano is still leading the charge with an 8.25 and a 5.75. As you can see on your screen now, Hubby looking for a 7.06. Totally doable for Jeff, but it's all right now. Mother Nature taking a yes. little break, so wave selection and a little bit of luck. It's what's going to come into play right now for Jeff Hubbard to get into that final with uh, Bobby Quinones. But Edder Luciano, he's on. He's been on a good one. Yeah, after losing that um, that non-elimination round where he had to compete in round five, he'd been on fire. Yes, he did. He beat out Dallas Singer yes. in uh, round number five. Uh, took out some Hawaiian. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Jason yeah. Oh, boy. And uh, he took uh, took you out in yeah. that he yeah. round six. He beat PLC in the second quarter, yes. the third quarter final. So here he is facing off Jeff Hubbard. So we might have two uh, two um, dark horses. Yeah, dark horses stomping their way <laughs> into the final. Wow. Enter Luciano. Can he hold off Jeff Hubbard? Jeff Hubbard's been on a good one as well, though, because his. Uh, his high flying antics have been taking him through each and every heat, but only one thing stops Edder from getting into that final, and it, it is Jeff Hubbard. Yes, um, the waves kind of stopped and it got kind of windy. So we'll see what happens on these sets. Come on. So now we know for a fact that uh, Dave Winchester being knocked out of the semifinals by Bobby Quinones, we will see the world title race finish off in Fronton for yes. the NMD versus Fronton Pro. If that's 
If there's any event you're going to want to see, that is the event that's going to go down most likely with the most views of, of all the events. That is incredible. That's going to be coming up. Uh, December 7th is the start of the event window. Yes. Oh, my. Oh, my gosh. Department of Sports and Recreation, Madaya Light, Madaya Light, Malta, India, Gasolina, the party in the pouch, that stuff's tasty. Yes. Uh, Vias del Mar, how? La X, the official radio station for bodyboarders here in Puerto Rico. There is the live action. What is going on out in the water? Isabella Municipality, thank you very much. Sprite, Vitamin Water, and Puerto Rico Sports Network. These are the people that are making this event happen and making it one of the top, you know, one of the favorites of most of the competitors and staff. So keep doing what you're doing. Pan Pepin as well. Puerto Rico Wire, Choice Cable, Banana Boat, El Nuevo Dia, official newspaper of the event, and Jogen Frus. We have uh, a ton more sponsors we want to name down, but uh, we'll get to that as the heat advances on. So here we are, ladies and gentlemen, in semifinal number two. It did slow down a bit. The action did slow down a bit, but uh, up and riding, Edder Luciano. Edder Luciano, oh, no way. That way it was just a small froth burger. <laughs> yes. Edder Luciano ducking under that one as he it makes his like way It looks like we got a couple sets. Jeff Hubbard with the priority. Where in you his at? Head. Checking it out. Here, Here we go. Here he goes in yellow. Finding a line. You're going to do an ARS. Oh, my. Oh, uh, that Tight is spin. Keep going. Nice roll. Wow. That's just clutch riding. I mean, he made that thing out of nothing. I thought it was just going to be an open face wave <laughs> all the way across to the inside. But did you see his stall? When we look at the replay, we'll talk it through. But this is some very technical yep. riding and very, you know, the skills. So when he takes off, the, the wedge has already passed him. So now he's behind the wedge, but he's able to stall on the takeoff and go straight off the bottom and pull off an ARS. Not everybody in the world can yeah. do that. Jeff Hubbard is one of those rare, uh, you know, bodyboarders that can pull this off. And he has a combination of three maneuvers he's before that it. even wave, you know, goes 10, 15 yards. So he was able to put together three and guess solid what? moves within that short run. Jeff is in first now. He got a 7.23 on that last wave. So he jumps up into the lead. And now, at a Luciano, he only needs a 5.93, which is fully, he can get it with ease. So. 12 minutes. Look at this set rolling uh -oh. in. He sees it. He's lying it, looking at where to set up. It's not looking like it's going to yeah, have any shoulder frothy. on him, so yeah. he p paddles over that. But he does have the priority in his hands. Again, thank you all for tuning in. A couple names to shout outs for those who are tuning in. <coughs> Chris Joyner, sorry. Chris Joyner tuning in. Uh, Land of the Hot pepper Peppers, or Hot Pepper Powders, Delaware. Uh, uh -oh. Chris Joyner actually has his uh, little. I keep saying little, but I'm thinking mm -hmm. of the peppers, but he does have uh, Hot Pepper Powders. Uh, company, which um, I may have to put in a request for that uh, when I get home. Dylan Short, he is in Australia. Matt tuned in from the UK. Ben is in West Oz. Jason Port Macquarie. Ben is in Portugal. Bruno as I is in Brazil. Eduardo in Portugal. Aiden is tuned in from the Gold Coast. He's with uh, Aaron. And uh, yes, shout outs to Aaron and Aiden. What up, boys? It must be late night over there and probably sucking down some cold ones. Mm -hmm. Justin on the Gold Coast, and uh, we got Zach also tuned in. So we have the Dominican right. Republic, and now we have Edder Luciano. Edder Luciano up and riding, driving a clean line. Oh, kind of a force ARS. I don't think that's going to go into the top two. I think that, but you never know. Here's Jeff Hubbard flying down the line. No, nope, he's going to hold priority, get back out there. That wave was kind of weak anyway. He knows what to do. Well, Jeff uh, currently in the lead right now, holding yes. steady. That that quick little wave exchange, I don't think will make a difference because Eder Luciano has an 8.25 and a 5.75. So both of these waves, let's take another look at Eder Luciano's wave. He punches through the lip a little late, but is uh. able to pull off an ARS somehow and whips that around and kicks out. That'll be in the three, maybe four-point yeah. range. Yeah. But uh, Eder Luciano... And Jeff Hubbard's last wave, I don't even think we're going to show that because there was really nothing there for Jeff Hubbard. But Jeff Hubbard and Andrew Luciano going head-to-head -head in semifinal number two. Manny V here with uh, Jacob Vandervelde. Ten minutes remaining Ooh. out in the water. Oh, doctor, this is a <laughs> intense last is. few heats. So I know for sure 
that uh, my boys in Mazatlan are tuned in. We're actually going to set up a Mazatlan Freak Fest. I'm, gonna, I'm actually setting it up. Sorry, not the IBA, but I have my own little tour company. Uh, I put together Cabo Freak Fest, yes. the Indo Experience, and uh, I'm going to organize a Costa Rica one in May and get into Mazatlan for September. So Manny and Zunza and the Mazatlan boys are always tuning in, and the boys in Woo! Cabo What's up, boys? tuned in as well. Yeah. All right, so here we go. Nine minutes remaining. Where wow. are we at? Wow. So it looks like... Uh, Edder's still in second, and he still needs a 5.93, and we have nine minutes remaining. So this is a tight heat. Anybody's heat right now. Tres Palmas, Kokomo, The Room, Caliche, Wave Rebels, Custom X, and Pride. Those are some of the surf shops and industry supporters of the Encanto Yes, Pro. Custom X is the boards I ride. I love them. Yeah, Custom X has been a stronghold here in Puerto Rico, and uh, thanks to, you know, the guys like Rene and uh, Carlos Rivera, yes. one of the old school riders who is uh, by far one of my favorites. I hope he still gets out in the water. Rene, according to Rene, he does still get out in the water, but now his life as a lawyer. Um, wow. Yeah, he's That's a lawyer a now. Change. So if, you, if you're in Puerto Rico and you need a bodyboarding lawyer, <laughs> if you want a lawyer that bodyboards, find Carlos Rivera. He will make sure he takes care of you. He usually hangs out at Hollow's down the road so Carlos Rivera if you're watching shout out to you brother I miss you out in the water eight minutes 12 seconds remaining here we go coming down to the wire yeah. can Jeff Hubbard fend off Edder Luciano out in the water again this wave this heat just slowed slow down. mother nature but Jeff's gonna wait for a good one because he has priority and Edder I think Edder's gonna look for a, a inside one to tell you the truth so we'll see how this plans out here um we have about 7.30 left, so, whoo, yes, tight yes. one. Honoree in the Dominican Republic. We got Porl in West Oz. Ken Richards in Yamba, Australia. Gunner has been tuning in from Melbourne, Florida every single day. Uh, he was going for Winnie, but uh, unfortunately, Winnie did not take it in uh, or did not pull off the win against Bobby Quinones. We do have uh, Gunner tuned in every single day. Ken Richards in Yamba, Australia, Mike. We got to oh, we got Jeff no, Hubbard dropping in, out. and oh. out he goes. I so think he just lost priority on that. I think, uh, yeah, we'll take a look at yeah, the priority we'll boxes. Yes, yes, it did change. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. We do have uh, the expression session coming up. You can see, um, I think that is Ike Raffles in the white jersey. Coming up, Edder Luciano. Nice, yeah, nice ARS, ARS right there from Edder. Unbelievable. Well, so, Edder Luciano uh, showing you uh, what he's, he has in his yes. pocket of arsenal Is he going weapons all the way right in there. again? Yes, he's going to pull oh, that one all oh, the way in. He's oh, on the hunt oh. for 5.93, so he's going to do everything, what? milk that thing. He's got the power and energy to get back out there within the six-minute mark. So, he's going to go all the way back out. But you know what? That's probably a smart move. He knows that there's enough time for him to take that all the way in. He knows it's only 5.93 that he needs so he's going to take it all the way to the beach yes. and then jump back out. Six minutes is enough time for him to get back out in that little rip current and get out there for another wave. So, again, Ryan and Cali, and we do have Taylor Nix in Kauai. Yes, hubby's hometown as well. Wow. So thank you all for tuning in. And uh, Edder's in first, buddy. Yes. What? Yes. Oh, ho, ho, ho. He got a 6.58. That is it. I'm telling you, he is going to suck out every single piece of energy out of the wave to be able to pull off a win here against Jeff Hubbard. Now, Jeff Hubbard heard the scores over the loudspeaker. Now he's going to be itching away to try to get a 7.61. Edder Luciano. Wow. Oh, doctor. Yes, old doctor. We need one. Wow, look at this replay on this one. He stalled for the lip, did an ARS. He's pulling around the section, kind of dug a rail. Uh, it's kind of frothy roll, and he milked it all the way to the inside. I don't know. I don't know about that score, but it's okay. 
I'm uh, not judging. You know you're, what I mean? You're, you're, <laughs> now, they, yeah, now you're you're not a judge, and you're not in the com- competition anymore. So you can be as biased as you want. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yes. Uh, Hawaiian going for Hawaiian, of course. You're going to be a little on the biased side, which is all good. This is uh, the live feed coming to you from the webcast booth here at Middles in Puerto Rico for the Encanto Pro, brought to you by. Oh oh, Jeff Hubbard up and riding in yellow. Here he goes. Oh no. This is not the wave he wants. Bail ASAP. As you can see, the conditions change from heat yes. to heat. And Jeff Hubbard, he is uh, not in priority now. You can see out in the water, red has priority. Edo Luciano, the Brazilian, currently in first place. Wow. Uh-oh. This could be the end of the run if Edo Luciano could minutes. fend off Jeff Hubbard from getting a 7.91 ride. Or, sorry, 7.61 is what Jeff Hubbard needs on his next wave. Can Edder Luciano knock out Jeff Hubbard from making it into the final? Hold on to your seats, people. We'll find out in three minutes and 45 seconds. Wow. Woo. Uh-oh, I need somebody in there to help me out, man. This is nerve-wracking. Yes. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, we will have an expression session. I don't believe we're going to be showcasing that, but uh, the riders will be out there having a good time in some pretty fun waves. I wish I was out there. But... Uh, we will give the semifinalists a little break. To, uh, Bobby Quinones is resting right now, and we're going to give uh, the winner of this heat a little break as well as we get into the final. The last heat of the Encanto Pro will be coming up after the expression session, so you guys stay tuned. We're not going anywhere, and we want to make sure you watch who will walk away with the win here at the Encanto Pro 2012, brought to you by CPuertoRico.com. Manny here, Manny V here with uh, Jacob Vandervelde. Yes. Jacob, my heart rate is. <laughs> no, I'm nervous control. right now, man. Just <laughs> my boy. I'm sorry. You know what I mean? I got love for all the Brazilians, right? But Jeff is my boy, and I just, I just want him to get a wave. At least have an opportunity to get the score. If he doesn't get it, then so be it. Well, we're coming down to the two minute and forty five second mark. You can see it on your screen. The the situation right now. Can Jeff Hubbard? Find that 7.61. It is Eder Luciano who has priority right now out in the water. But shout out to George who's watching from east in to the east in San Juan. Gavin is in London. And Jeff up back. and riding. Oh, this looks like it could be something nice for Jeff oh, Hubbard. Oh, Look at this section oh, oh. coming up. Oh, oh my. Jeez. Jeff Hubbard, he will that take was it. Sick. A 7.61, a nice, clean, that smooth was a big ARS one. out into the flats, pulls it off. And I think uh, we just lost all sound in mic number two from Jacob Valdervelli. Valdervelli yelling yeah, in the <laughs> That was crazy. He went big on that one. He, that was a good ramp. You know what? He looks at his watch. Jeff Hubbard taking a look. Does he have enough time to get back out into the outside? No. I don't know if he does or not. He's going to probably call it a heat. And now Andrew Luciano waiting for those scores to drop and finding out what he's going to need if uh, Jeff Hubbard did come up with a 7.61. Let's take another look. Wow. He was driving. He had a clean line, and he's just flying it. Look at this. Oh, man. That was heavy. That was epic. Me? Big ARS. From yes, Jeff Hubbard, dropping. and the scores are dropping right now for Jeff Hubbard's gigantic ARS right there out in the flats. I know it was going to be a big air move. Wait, he's not done. He took that all the way to the inside. I know it was going to be a big air wow. move, but um, because he took that all the way wow. to the inside, ten, wow. one minute, 10 seconds remaining. Scores are dropping. Did Jeff did. come up with that seven-point ride? Yes, he did. A 7.78. Edward Luciano now in second place. Looking for a 6.76 with less than a minute to go. Look at Jeff waiting. Oh, he's this just This is saying, the longest minute of his life. This will be the longest minute of the this <laughs> year for Jeff Oh, Hubbard. my gosh. Oh, my. Can he pull it off? Are we going to do this? Is Jeff going to hold on to a 7.78? Hold steady. Can Edder Luciano... Grab a 7.76, 30 seconds remaining. Oh, my. This is going to be a heartbreaker if, if Edder Luciano can find a good one. Jeff looking out to the <laughs> horizon. Oh, my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. Can yeah. Edder Luciano in this last Oh, year, shit. The They're just showing is Jeff. On. This the is crazy. I'm sorry. Is oh. on right now for oh Jeff Hubbard. Oh, my God. Seven, six, 
five, four, nothing out the back for Ed or Luciano. That will be the end of the wow. round. Wow. Oh, that was epic. Ed or Luciano could not find it. But Jeff Hubbard finds that solid 7.78. Oh, my Madden. gosh. Where are you at, Hawaiians? Where are you at? The last two minutes of that heat. Oh, my. Oh. George tuning in from San Juan. Gavin in London. Justin in Western Australia. Randy tuned in from Yakima, Washington. Holy mackerel. Bodyboarder Surf Co., the Winnie Fan Club tuned in. David Hall, thank you for tuning in from the Jersey Channel Islands. We just saw Jeff Hubbard take out Edder Luciano. In the last two minutes wow. of this uh, semifinal number two, that was an amazing run right there for Jeff Hubbard. Wow, he 